How's it going everybody? Sage the Collector back with another random retail pack rip. Uh, Optic seems to be right on the cusp of coming out, but still no Optic on the retail shelves. I saw Schultze somehow got his hand on one blaster, but that's the only box of uh, Optic I've seen ripped on YouTube so far. So until I can get my hands on some, we're ripping some random packs. But you know what we do first. We open some mail. First up is a little uh, part of a trade I did with fan of the channel, Neil. We did a little, uh, he sent me a surprise pack a couple weeks ago. Then uh, I sent him some stuff and then he was going to send me this sweet Pippin back. I did not have this in the Pippin PC, so that's pretty cool. And then he threw in a few extra cards. We got a little Ben Simmons cracked ice, Tatum, Three T minus three two one, and then an Azabuki. Oh my God! Look at how small that's. That is the smallest signature I've ever seen. So there you go, rookie Azabuki signature out of prison. So there you go. Thank you, Neil. Next up, we got. Okay, what else? Recon Maneuvers. This time we got De'Aaron Fox checked off the list. Oh, wait, there's two in here. Haha, -ha, they're on the back. Kyrie is also checked off the list. So a twofer. Stay tuned to my uh, Instagram page. I will be posting a video when I finally finish the set. I'll do a nice video of all showcasing all the cards in the set. There we go. It's Zach. It's red. It was cheap. So I had to pick it up. It's a little off center, so that's kind of why I got it so cheap. I think I paid like two bucks and change for this, but man, red prism Zach, done. Going in the binder. Ooh, there we go. I think I already picked a Cade up. Maybe did I? Maybe accidentally win two Cades. Either way, Cade decently centered. Not too bad. Maneuvers are really hard to find centered. You can really tell the centering by looking at the spacing next to the M and then the spacing next to the S. But this one's pretty decent, and it's Cade. Rookie Maneuvers. Very cool. And we got another envelope in a... Boy, I got one of these last time, too. So I wonder if I won two cards by the same seller. Ooh, there you go. It's red. <laughs> it's a bowl. And it is stuck in that sleeve. But there you go. P. Will Red Mosaic. I don't think I had a debut red yet, so finally bit the bullet and paid. A, I probably paid like three, four bucks for it, which is maybe a little over what it's worth, but I don't know, man. I'm feeling good about this season with the Bulls, and P. Will is going to be part of that. So I'm not, I'm not too disappointed in paying, paying up for that. There you go, Lamelo. Definitely I've already picked up one of these before, but you know what that means. That means if I accidentally pick up two, that means one of them is going in a Sage's Surprise Pack. And speaking of su Sage's Surprise Packs, they are finally officially sold out. Thank you to none other than Spurs Cards 21 for buying the last couple. Definitely helped me out, so thank you, Eddie. That just means I'm now going to be working on Series 2 of the uh, Surprise Packs. Thinking about what to do to kick it up a notch just a little bit to make it exciting. But here we go. Zach Levine. And we're going to free this card. My first Team All Red Flood Zach. And, you know, unfortunately it's a die cut so you don't get a whole lot of red. Like the red, like the base Team All Red Floods that are, you know, vertical and fully full red cards. Those are super sweet. But man, you can still see that red shine. Man, these are cool. The Red Floods are awesome. And last but not least, you know what the shiny shiny bubble mailer means. That means I got into an AMT break, and it was another Zack Obsidian. This was the final one I was in. And once again, I did not get shut out. Got this sweet tunnel vision and got a base tunnel vision numbered to 25 in the base was i thought numbered where is it no so just a regular old base okay i guess it's just a regular base levine didn't have it so that's going in the pc but this is the big one man i love these tunnel visions 
That is just a sweet card. I, it's It kind of sucks that it's not die cut, but I actually don't mind this not being a die cut this year. So there you go. Two more Zack Obsidians for the PC, and that is it for mail. We are on to packs. It's the usual set of packs, except these are new. I got a box of these fat packs, but I think everything else might have appeared in a previous random retail pack rip. But here we go. We're going to start off with Prism. <laughs> Get it out of the way early. Ooh, got some ice. Got Bogdanovich. Super bent Bogdanovich. Got Cam Johnson. Oh, there we go. Sorry, Prism. I didn't mean to... I didn't mean... Oh, boy, is that off-center, though. Holy cow. Look how thin that is on the left. All right, Ed, look at his face. Love it. Either way, Giddy. And then we got a Ice of Gordon Hayward. So we got a Giddy, even though it's way off-center. We got Marcus Howard. Who is Marcus Howard? Hmm. Got Rashid. We got a Silver. Not a rookie. Danny Green. And our ice is, oh, there you go. Kobe going in the PC. I'm putting him up there because any PC card, that goes up top. Don't have that for sure. Love it. Can't wait to see what Kobe does this year. And we are on to select, and I believe this came out of a mega box. Yeah, that's right. We're doing the red, uh, we're doing the Christmas ice. We got Bam. We got Anyeka. The Christmas ice is Brandon Clark. And we got a true blue of LeBron. Very cool. That'll be in the surprise pack for sure. We got a Tyrese rookie, Kemba. Our ice is Rui, and we got a numbers of Ben Simmons. On to 2020 hoops. And I believe this came out of Omega, so we're looking for those explosions, and we have an explosion. Very cool. Kevin Love, Dejounte, Herder, Montrez, and our. Explosion is oh jersey swap. Nice onto de Kumpo brothers. Got that purple explosion onto de Kumpo jersey swap. Very cool. And our two rookies are Tyrell Terry and RJ. Alright, got one more. Hopefully we got another explosion. Ooh, I think we did. Very nice. Got Danilo, Dylan, Bogdanovich, got the fro. Al Horford, and, ooh, we got a green. Got a green explosion. That means it's numbered to 99, I think. Oh, and it's Kelly Oubre. Okay, all right. Numbered to 99, green explosion, so that's cool. Sorry, LeBron, cover you up a little bit. And our rookies are Elijah and CJ Ellaby. So, got a numbered card out of retail. That is noteworthy. It's only Kelly Oubre, but I'm not complaining. All right, on to Chronicles. Got RJ... Jay Sean, CP. Oh no, they wasted the pink on the base, Tobias. And we finish with a Vassell Rookie XR. Oh, wait a minute. Skipping. I'm skipping ahead here. Got one more Chronicles. Ooh. Got something. Uh, maybe a, I think we got a bent chrome card here. Oh, it looks like a Phoenix. Ooh, Silver Phoenix. Very nice. Got Josh Reed. Oh, there you go. Lamello. Very nice. Oh, nice, Ant-Man. This is a pack. Silver D-Book Phoenix. Man, love that. Sorry, Kobe. And then Jaden McDaniels on the marquee. So that was a pack. Very nice. On to Mosaic. Got Markel, Bam, Kyra. Got a little Jam Masters Green. Jason Richardson. <laughs> the stupid big heads. I still, I don't know, I don't I don't dislike him as much as I did at first, but I still don't love those things. Got Josh Kogi, Kelly Oubre, CJ LB Rookie, and a green Christian Wood. And <laughs> got a goofy face on Christian there. All right, on to our new Contenders Fat Packs. Let's see, what does it say? Retail Exclusive Rookie Season Ticket Stickers. Man, have I ever seen one of those? I'm not sure I even know what those are. Interesting. Well, let's see if we can pull one. We got a bunch of base. We got a little Zion action. Tatum. So the only good thing about contenders, you get a bunch of base, but all most of the base are guys you kind of want. Like all these are all stars. Van Vliet. Okay, our green is L Horford. 
We got an Azubuki on the draft class. Got a game night of Trey and a red. Man, he's got a weird, almost like he got punched. I got a draft class red of beef stew. So that's about what you get with contenders. <laughs> base, 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 base. Uh, you know, insert, insert, but nothing too exciting. We got Rudy. KP. Got Giannis. Got Zach. Clay. And got Spider. Jimmy Buckets. CP and our first parallel is a green Joker. That's not too bad. Got Bogdanovich. Oh, yeah, it's a Bogdanovich heavy, heavy uh, rip here. Another Devin Vassell. It's also been a Vassell heavy. And then we got a game night red of the beard. So I almost didn't pick up the box of Chronicles Fat Packs, but it was dirt cheap. So those were like maybe five bucks a pack. But and <laughs> that's about what you're getting so it's, uh, i don't know i'm still kind of on the fence of whether i wasted uh, some money on those but anyway it's it's a change of pace right it's a change of pace we are on to 2019 chronicles which means we are jaw young dolph hunting we haven't picked, pulled one in a while so hopefully we're due here got a romeo got a Giannis, got a jared culver cam reddish and our pink is Rui. One more pack. I'd settle for any jaw or Zion at this point. We got Jackson. Got another Giannis. Got a rookie, Romeo, Garland, and KPJ. So no jaw again. So I think the last two random retail rips, I haven't pulled a single jaw out of Chronicles, which is disappointing. Anyway, got some more packs. We are on to 21 hoops. I believe this is out of Blaster. So we got Poku, CP, we got Jimmy Buckets. And we're, I'm trying to put all the, the big names down there. Jaron Jackson. Got a frequent flyer of Rudy. And we got our rookie is Charles Bassey. Oh boy, we have gone cold here. After that, after that awesome Chronicles pack, it's been Deadsville here. Tobias Cole, Mello. Uncle Jeff, Malcolm, P. Will, and hey, finally, a jaw. I'll take it. It's not a big job, but at this point, I'll take anything. And a rookie is Trey Mann. We have a lone pack of Optic. Hopefully, it can produce something. We got LeBron. Nice. Grant Riller is a rookie. Vooch, we got a purple. Hey, Kobe White. Okay, that's going in the PC. I'll take that. All right, we got two packs of Donruss and two packs of Illusion. We're going to start off with the Donruss here. Got Aaron Gordon, Luca, Luca, okay. Ant-Man, second year, Buddy, Zion. And we got a franchise features of Julius Randle. So, yeah, Donruss being Donruss at this point. We got Herder, Dragon, Steven Adams, Obi. Ooh, there you go. Jalen Green, rookie. And we got a green of Boucher. All right, so our, our, uh, our parallels haven't been the best, except for, you know, Silver D-Book. <laughs> Still nothing too exciting, but... All right, we got a Kendrick Nunn. Actually, those Donruss packs, I thought came out of a Mega. Yeah, so they got the green, the green ice. So, yeah, that was our only real exciting green ice there. We got k Nun Dragon. Season highlights of Sabonis, Victor, and we got rookies of Reggie Perry and Sadiq Bay. Final pack. Okay, well, so far it's not the greatest, not the worst, but not the greatest. Ooh, we got a acetate, which unfortunately they didn't do this year, which is very disappointing. Jay Crowder. We got Marcus. Got a clear shots of Larry Bird. Man, these, these acetates are awesome. How could they stop doing those? That's just disappointing. Got Markel Fultz, Robert Covington, and our last rookie is Aaron Nesmith. So, not the greatest break, but, I mean, as you can see, we did get a lot of semi-notable cards. So let's choose some cards for the giveaway. And uh, I'm just, I'm not even going to go through them. I'm just going to say any card you want from this whole stack. Let me know what your favorite pull was from the break. Let me know what card you want in this stack, and you could win that card. But our hits, even though they've got a couple, uh, 
A couple PC cards thrown in with the hits. Got a Jalen Green rookie. Got a Luka. LeBron. Got a Ja. Ant-Man rookie. Got a Mellow rookie. Got this cool jersey swap explosion. Got the Larry Bird clear shots. Boucher. So, I mean, there's some cool cards. PC Kobe, PC Kobe, and this horribly off-center Giddy. So, uh, not the greatest, but man, I don't know. There's just, when you rip random retail packs, it doesn't even matter what you pull sometimes. It's just super fun to rip a bunch of retail. And the way Panini is releasing stuff or not releasing new stuff, uh, I'm going to be doing this for the foreseeable future, I think.